hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl is in the williams how are you all doing hope you guys are doing great hope you guys are having fun yes it's the 28th day of the month of december so i'm gonna start by saying a very happy birthday to sucre papito himself the sugar daddy himself none other than sheyi awolowo yes today is his birthday he is a December baby so a happy birthday to him now also yesterday was um Churchill or Lacunle's birthday that is um turned to the case ex-husband yesterday was his birthday now hmm okay so you guys remember Rosalie Murrah I hope that's her name like that I hope I got the pronunciation correctly well um back then in 20 was it 2017 there was a time that Tonto Dike accused her of snatching her husband from her before i even go back to that story or go into that story um yesterday she hosted in fact she threw a surprise birthday party um for churchill and she went on to instagram to post this picture that is here and she had this you know caption for it and i'm gonna read she said it's that time of the year when i celebrate someone very very special to me a king a leader and a blessing to this world was born today dear mr churchill um take every birthday wish you receive today multiply all the love you find in them by one thousand then add years of joy wonder and prosperity to the mix and and it still would not equal the love joy wonder and prosperity i wish for you you are my biggest trend and i wish every day of your life be filled with biggest um okay i wish every day of your life be filled with achievement and satisfaction May God bless your new age and soak you with abundance of grace and protection. Shine on and never let anyone dull your sparkle. Hmm. Have a blessed and joyous day, sweet. Love you, Rosie. Hmm. 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 Okay, now this um, was what she wrote. This was what she wrote to Tonto Dike's ex-husband. Now, if I look at it again... You will think, okay, there's nothing wrong with it, right? Okay. You might feel there's nothing wrong with it. But, but, um, looking at the background of this whole thing between Rosalind, Churchill, Tones of Decay, then you start asking yourself, what's that thing they still say about um, there's no smoke without fire? Mm -hmm. You guys remember, I think that was back in 2017, when Tonto Decay, you know, came out and laid allegations against this particular lady that she um, um, is out to break her home, that she made her husband to abandon her and her child, that's Tonto Decay and her child, for two good months, that... Um, you know, then we used to think, okay, maybe Rosalind was related to Tonto Dike, you know, Tonto, um, sorry, Tonto Dike's ex-husband, Churchill, then, then she came out to say, like, you know what, this lady is never in any way, or was never in any way related to my husband, that this lady, she, I didn't even know this lady before I married my husband, now I've married my husband, that two, these two people are having an affair, that these two people are in love, not just any her relationship, yeah, Tonto Dike bared it all in that interview, if I can remember, yes, um, she said a lot she accused rosalyn even then i remember rosalyn did not rosie or rosalyn she didn't she said she debunked that rumor she said it was just a baseless allegation that is irritating to hear and all that but ever since she started you know associating with mr churchill you know and his foundation we've been seeing the next thing we saw was a new car changing of wardrobe you know traveling abroad she's always with him these days and even yesterday evening both of them stepped out in matching outfits hmm. Hmm. well i don't know what to say all i can say is mm, well all i can say is there's no smoke without fire i guess we are seeing this fire you know that um that tone to the kid was talking about two years ago so yeah that is it now moving on so um you all know this whole thing about EK on following Mercy and all the whatnots that followed. So EK was in Oweri. In fact, three of them were in Oweri. Yes. So EK was in Oweri. Um, Mercy was in Oweri. Tacha was in Oweri. In fact, Oweri was lit. 
yes so over where was lit and i've got all the videos yes so i'm giving you guys inside everything that happened in owere or that might still be happening you know in owere i'll have the clips for you at the end of this video so make sure you stick around yes so ek was in owere he was having massive fun so he had like a brief interview and he was asked about mercy yes in that interview it was like an impromptu interview from what i saw and he was asked about mercy uh, mercy sorry and this is what he had to say mm -hmm. I, I saw the love i saw the love you and mercy had in the house mm -hmm. so tell us how is she where is she is she in the room somewhere no no no, no. Mercy, mercy not here right now you know uh you know that was she's so busy now busier than me uh you know everything's good everything's good she's she's in a worry okay yeah but you know, the same way I have events back to back over there, you know, in her village she has events back to back. So um, maybe next time you guys. So see guys, her. you guys have but, heard uh, it from man, EK, you know. Um, I feel ride. that's a very intelligent and, a and a matured answer he gave. Um, yeah, I feel that's a very intelligent answer. He didn't go, you know, he didn't. He didn't over talk. Yes, he did not over talk. Meanwhile, Mercy was confirmed conferred with its chief tenancy title. Yes, the Ugoma one of Ebuland. So if you see her right now, you're not gonna just address her as Mercy. She is now a chief. She is now a titled woman. Yes, so so they got to respect her. Now, hmm, you all know um in the last video I did, I I announced, I broke the news, not like broke the news now because the news has always been there, you know, that about Gedoni and Cafe's engagement, right? Now, what followed was what made me so, like, I kept laughing all through. So, Tasha went on. Okay, Tasha is not the one that got engaged. It's her best friend that got engaged. It was Cafe that got engaged. Now, in um Kathy's page, so people were not congratulating Kathy. Guess what? Tachana went to Ka um Kathy's page and was not thanking everybody that was congratulating um Kathy. So if somebody says, "Oh, congratulations," Tacha will not reply, "Thank you," as if she is the one. It was very, very funny and hilarious for me. Like she's already, in fact, she even went on to tell people that she's now call her T the wedding planner so uh, obviously it is not just um Kathy's wedding it is both Kathy and Tatcha's wedding the way I am seeing it still on that Kathy's engagement so people were now calling out Nina hmm. they were not telling Nina ah bam bam and said they got married though eh uh, now is Kathy and Gedon new and you all know why they are saying it you all know why they are saying it okay let me if you don't know why they are calling out nina i'll tell you why okay teddy a and bam bam they were famous for something in the house when they were in the house they were famous for fellowshipping together even you know thinking under the sheet thinking we are not gonna know in the bathroom and all that you know Kathy and Gedoni. We are also, there was this also allegation that they also fellowshiped under the duvet, you know, thinking that we are not going to see. We started seeing some movement, looking for something. I don't know what Gedoni was looking for under the duvet, but we know there was, it looks like a movement, you know. So, and Nina and Miracle, oh, that was like the most famous of them all. Like, it was just there. The fellowshipping was, ah, oh girl, the fellowshipping was just there. You know, let's just leave it like that. So because of that, people are like, okay, oh, the fellowship, the three fellowships, the other one is married, the other one is engaged. What about your own? You know, why is it that your own did not get to that level? After all, the fellowship you did on TV, you know? So, Dina now decided to reply. She was not like, I don't get why my name is being mentioned in this whole BBM marriage thing. Must I marry a big brother housemate? I bet you all ain't ready for me, though. LOL. So, hmm, Nina now answered them. Am I happy with Nina's response? Oh, yes, I am. Because really, um, it's not a must. It's really, really not a must that she must marry a husband. Whatever happened in the house happened in the house. So they are out of it. Now, people should stop disturbing Nina. The fact that it worked out for Bamba Bantere and it worked out for Gedroni and Kafi doesn't mean it will work out for you no know, other people. By, um, 
even looking at it they're not the only ones that were in a relationship now and so and lulu oh talking about lulu guys lulu is off the market yes um some weeks ago or months ago or yeah that was back in november or october if i'm not mistaken i'm sorry i did not give you guys just um lulu was in, he engaged that his famous or infamous girlfriend yes so he's off the market so like i was saying back to what i was saying um lulu and anto it didn't work out um alex and leo you all know did not work out um cc and toby that one even broke apart even before they left the house it was that one was <laughs> let's not even go there the other relationships like that they didn't make it out but the difference between bam bam teddy gedoni kafi and nina america from all these other ones is because of the fellowshipping that happened yes so guys um moving on the your faves were in or like i said um Mercy was given a chief tennis title. Oh, we also got to meet uh, Mercy's mom. Wow. <laughs> when I saw Mercy's mom, I was like, oh, like there's nothing as beautiful as celebrating your mother because mothers are so special, you know. And uh, it broke my heart when um, I saw the video of um, Mercy's mom in one blog and somebody actually commented something that it really really broke my heart like guys okay i gotta say this people have trolled tacha's late mom people are now trolling mercy's mom it's not cool it's really really not cool you know i'm i'm just gonna say it here you know me i like saying my own it's not cool do not say because this person is your fave or this person is not your fave, you will not be disrespecting their mothers. Mothers have a special place, you know. They are a place nobody can even see. They are so special. Nobody should do that. No matter if you like Tachao or if you like Mercy or if you don't like them, do not come for their moms. That's just it. There's a line to these things. Why? Like, why? It doesn't even make any sense. Anyways, Mercy's mom was very... She's very adorable. Mothers are so special. So if you want to see Mrs. Mom, um, stick to the end of the video. I'm gonna post. I'm gonna put, you know, the video of her and her mom, and also the video of where um her mom brought her food. Yes, there's nothing as good as mother's food. Seriously, my mom's. I can cook very well, but when mommy cooks for me, haha, <laughs> I must finish the food because it's so special. Anyways, guys, that's about it for today. And um, Tacha was also in Calabar. She was opportune to visit the. She was opportune to visit the ex-governor of the state, um, Donald Duke, and his wife. And she, it was a grand reception for her in Calabar. Really, baby girl is living, she's living her life. She, Like she said in her one of her interviews, said she is party after party. That is what she came to do in Calabar. So I feel she's having fun. They are all having fun. Um, the clips of that are also put at the end of this video. So just stick around yes so guys thank you so much for being part of my channel you could tell i just woke up and carried my phone and decided to do video yes <laughs> don't mind me okay guys take care of yourself be good and please do not forget to subscribe do not forget to share really share to your instagram page share to other people because this family has got to grow yes guys thank you so much guys and don't forget to comment also and if you have not already the, um subscribe please subscribe if you've subscribed click on the notification bell so you know whenever i post any new video so guys till um i do another video take care of yourself bye
Hey, mommy. You brought food for me? <laughs> Did you bring food for me? Yes. <laughs> okay.